Hello YouTube, my name is Anil and you are watching TubeMate. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can check your Shopify store sessions across the world, where your visitors are coming from, where your buyers are coming from, whether they are converting or not. Okay, so let's go ahead and check your sessions, internet sessions using web browsers okay now go ahead and log into your shopify admin make sure you have selected your desired store here and then what you can do you can go to marketing okay marketing and you can see it says online store sessions so this says what it does it does num it shows you the number of sessions on your online store a within a period of time okay. you might have more data this is my development store so i'm only going to show you the online store sessions you can check conversion rate total sales and average order value etc etc by pressing this this and this and these icons on each sections of boxes here so go to view report and then you can see it shows you the trend visitor trend date wise or day wise then top top traffic sources you can go ahead and check that so I'll show you that one and then top traffic locations so first sources and then country wise locations As you can see i'm getting mostly the direct uh, traffic people are typing in my url or just copy and pasting my url or clicking my url from particular somewhere on the internet so i'm getting from the direct is common then Bing and Facebook and two uh, then the related reports traffic by locations Oops, I just clicked it and now you can see I'm getting traffic from United States so when you click on particular country you also get uh, the state or yeah state names it doesn't give you the city names anymore. One state. Hmm. So this is how you can check it. And if you're getting more, more. visitors and sales what i would suggest you should do you should connect to shopify store with something like local studio by google google it is completely free and what it does it lets you connect both uh, google analytics if you have connected to this store and google search console and gives you combined data in one place and this is more of fun so this is g4 report i've got search console so i do not want these are my personal stuff so i do not want to get into this but this is the idea how you can save time and understand your data so this this is basically a tutorial I can show you how it might look like this is tutorial how you can set it up start here uh, console here yeah, template galleries okay this is Okay, you if you're running ads on with Google Ads, you can combine everything, right? 
analytics console and ads and this this is two you can see let's have a look at yeah two stuff so let's check this one e-commerce ppc basically you are tracking with analytics and promoting with google ads google ads this is how how it might look you can select your date from here you can you can even connect your store to this particular template and then you can edit it share it and do whatever you want all right so this is how it looks this is the most simplest one perfectly fine if you have a small store if you have much larger store traffic with lots of traffic and conversion and sales and you need something like this dashboard that can quickly tell you what's happening and this gives you more data than these very generic dashboards all right thank you so much for watching if you need any help support you can get in touch with me thank you so much for watching bye for